making a taco salad. Absolutely love to make a taco salad during the summer. Doesn't heat up your kitchen with the oven when it is so hot outside. Just have a little bit of um, ground beef to brown on your stove top. So that's the only heat that you need. Uh, so anyway, it's just great for summer. So anyway, let's just go ahead and get this taco salad recipe started. Okay, so I've got uh, three to four tablespoons of butter melted here in my skillet. And I'm gonna go ahead and add, uh, this is about a one and a half onions cut up and about, oh, eight cloves of garlic. Now, if you do not like onions and you do not like garlic, you do not have to add um, those at all to this recipe. It's okay to uh, leave them out. So I'm just gonna saute these a little while until they're kind of translucent. And then we'll be going ahead and adding in our ground beef. Okay, so now we're ready to go ahead and just add your ground beef right into your skillet here. And you're just going to cook this until this is nice and, and golden, I mean brown. You want it, you want it done. You don't want um, this underdone at all. So you want it nice and brown here. And uh, at this point, you can add salt and pepper if you like. Just a little bit of salt, a little bit of pepper. If you don't like pepper or you don't use salt, uh, you don't have to add it here. Okay, so we're just going to let this um, cook till it's nice and golden brown. Now, uh, at this point, you want to go ahead and add some taco seasoning. Now, you can um, use like uh, taco seasoning in the package. Or you can uh, purchase taco seasoning like this, which is what I do because I use a lot of it. And uh, I just put about, oh, an ounce or something like that in there. Now you can, when this is all done, you can taste it and see if you think it needs more. So you can add more if you want to. Uh, so we're just gonna get our ground beef all nice and brown here. And then we will be draining uh, any excess grease that we may have, we want to be sure and drain all of that off. And that will be um, uh, your ground beef mixture all ready to go into your taco salad. Okay, so now that our ground beef is all cooked and it has been drained and it has cooled down some because um, you want to let your meat cool down some. You don't want to put your salad together while your ground beef is still hot. Uh, so you're going to need a, a medium sized bowl and some uh, some lettuce. Now you can uh, buy your own lettuce and chop it. You can uh, buy chopped lettuce, you can buy shredded lettuce, which is what I like is the shredded lettuce. So I just have a bag here of um, shredded lettuce and now we're just going to add everything else. This is the uh, quickest, easiest uh, salad ever. Um, but anyway, so you've got your lettuce here, and we're gonna go ahead and add, oh, about a cup and a half of um, cheese. Now you can change the uh, amount of this, these ingredients, and that does not matter, whatever you like. Uh, I've got two chopped up tomatoes. She's looking oh so yummy. And then I'm going to go ahead and add my ground beef. Oh my goodness. Maybe I should have got a bigger bowl. <laughs> now I'm just going to uh, toss that up together here. Very carefully because I think I should have got a bigger bowl. That's what I think I really should have done. I uh, Last time I made it, um, I thought I used this bowl, but apparently I used the next size up. Um, so just go ahead and mix that all together. Okay, so <laughs> as you can see, I switched bowls because that other one was just not big enough. So this is the size bowl that you need, a great big one. Um, and so because you've got to toss all this together and that other one I just didn't have enough room. So anyway all that together and looking so good and smelling so awesome and you're just going to get it mixed up really well together and I just use a couple of big forks to do that and it's kind of looking like this oh my goodness now I'm going to go ahead and add a cup of uh, Catalina dressing just a salad dressing uh, I'm going to go ahead and add well, I'm going to start off with about a half a cup. If I need to add more, I can. Uh, it's easier to add than it is to take away. So, 
Let me get that mixed in. Oh yeah. Mm -mm. That looks so good. Yumminess, yumminess right here, y'all. Okay, and um, just a little bit more. Not much more. I, I think I'm more like a three-fourths cup is going to do you good. So. All right, and I'm also going to add to this some uh, crunch, uh, some, like I, I smashed some Doritos. That's what I did. I just put them in a plastic bag and hit them with my fist. <laughs> and so uh, you can use uh, Doritos. You can use taco shells if you want to. Um, or you can use, uh, what is those, are those corn chips? You can use those. So I've got uh, about a cup and a half of chopped up or smashed up Doritos that I'm going to add to the salad. Oh my goodness. Okay. Now, that's it for the taco salad. So quick, so easy, oh so yummy. So uh, you see what it looks like, taste absolutely wonderful which i'm going to do right now just to make sure that i do have enough dressing in there um the way that we like it i'm gonna use my big old fork <laughs> mm. Mm. that is good so <laughs> anyway this is my supper for tonight mine and my husband's supper i ain't gonna love it he loves this so anyway y'all I appreciate y'all watching. I'll see you again next time. Bye now.